Hello everybody, welcome back to the Horror Vault. This is day 18 of the uh, 31 Nights of Horror Challenge of 2017. Day's 18 film was The Manatui from 1978, which is based on the 1976 book by Graham Maston, also called The Manatui. This film, as you can see, stars Tony Curtis, Susan Straz, Berg, and Berge Burgess Meredith in a very small role, but it's kind of a, a fun role for him, so it's something different. But this is directed by uh, William Girdler, who majority of people who in, in into horror films would mostly know him for directing um, Grizzly, yeah, big giant bear in uh, 1976. Uh, this would have been William Girdler's last directed film in 1978, he died shortly after, but. Uh, another film he did was uh, the transportation film Sheba Baby, starring Pam McGreer, who did Coffee and those other black exploitation movies, quite well known. Um, so, just this movie is there's a, a Native American, 400 year old Native American, coming back in through a woman who doctors believe is a tumour. They later realise realize it's a fetus growing on the back of her neck. They soon discover it's growing bigger and bigger, so. Her friend, Tony Curtis, who plays a uh, somewhat psychic character, goes in search of a, a Native American who, or Native American medicine man who should be able to get rid of this Manitoui on his back, on her back, sorry, and uh, they have a big fight at the end, the, the psychic, the Native American, and the Manitou who finally comes out through the woman, and hopefully gets rid of the uh, the Manitoui, but anybody who's read the books by Graham Maston from uh, the Manitoui all the way up through until uh, 2015 there's been uh, I think there's been six six or five, no six long you know, novel stories based on the Manitoui and there's been one short story all written by Graham Maston so if you want to find out more about the Manitoui type thing check them out but obviously check out the first book, which this is based on, The Manatee, I quite like this film. It was quite a, a quite a big hit at the time. It's quite hard to find on DVD. I don't, I don't even know it's on Blu-ray to be honest, but it's worth picking up if you can find it. I quite enjoy it, but then I'm, I'm a big fan of Graham Masterton type stuff. Um, the music that done this is by Lalo Schifrin, which is quite a quite an interesting music thing. Um, if you want to play something fun with this film, if you're a drinker, you don't have to be a drinker. I mean, if you're like me, you just drink fizzy stuff or tea or whatever. But you should, uh, every time somebody says the words Pana Witchy Salatu, which is the thing that uh, the woman who's been uh, having the fetus coming up through, Everybody seems to go around, especially Tony Curtis, he goes around trying to explain to people what Panha Witchy Salatu is. So every time somebody says that in the in the uh, the film, I would say turn it into a drinking game and take a drink. I'm sure, depending on your drink of uh, option, if you're if you're a drinker, you will probably be drunk by the end of the film because it's just said quite a lot. But <laughs> it's it's a great film. I really enjoy it. If you've seen it, let me know in the comments down below and. Another fun thing to uh, let me know is this is the only one that I know of that's based on a Graham Masterton book. If there's any other films out there done by him, let me know. And if there isn't, let me know in the comments down below which book by Graham Masterton you would like to be seen turned into a film. Because there's quite a few books of his that could be turned into a film and they'd be really good to see. As always, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Like, share and subscribe and as I always say, thanks for watching and we'll see you in this video. Bye for now.